Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of American Truck Simulator. With me, me heard 37. We have a mail. We got I didn't look at it last time. Our brand new Kenworth trucks for sale. We are a certified retailer of Kenworth trucks. We offer a wide selection of different configurations and we can also perform customization to accommodate any special wishes. Please visit our showroom in Los Angeles, the truck you've always dreamt of might be waiting just behind the door. We can't afford it. I don't want to go there, actually. <laughs> How would we even get there? We don't have a truck to get there. Alright, let's look at a quick jobs here. Oh, I guess we can, like, warp ourselves wherever we are. Is there anything short? Prim to LA. Doesn't pay a whole lot. Prim to Carl's, but oh, look, that pays way 900 bucks more. It's got more time left. Kind of like that truck. Taking fertilizer. All right, here we are. You have a new mail. How do we get more mail? I like that truck. No sleeper. Oops. All right, start her up. Just pull straight ahead. Where else would we go? Here we go. And out to the right. We're in the clear. Shout for this speed bumps up here. Well, it's not our truck. Can't damage fertilizer either. Alright. Oh, I was hitting the wrong button. I was hitting my blinker button instead of the brake. Right beside each other. Alright, here we go. Alright. Kinda wish we could listen to music, but uh, you know, we'd get a copyright violation if we actually did that. Because it's, it's like your truck simulator too. It's got a music folder. However, they did it stupidly again. Um, you gotta, instead of asking you where your music is, you gotta put your music in their folder. Um, which is stupid because then you got twice as much music on your hard drive taking up space. But I have a mod, and actually, the reason I found out, or not a mod, I have a program, I did a tutorial on YouTube about um, moving your scenery around uh, from one drive to another, even though you're not actually moving it around. And the whole reason I found that out was actually because of your truck simulator too. You can do that uh, for your music. Leave your music where it is and tell your computer, make a junction point to your, your, your truck simulator, your American truck simulator uh, music folder. And voila, you not have that problem. I don't know why they make, why do they don't just ask you where your music folder is. It's all, it's, it's what makes more sense. I don't know why they do that. Just say, hey, put your music in our folder. I don't, I don't understand. But yeah, just look for my tutorials on my, if you need to know how to do it. Uh, Junction Link Magic is the program. It's pretty easy. And I did a tutorial. You should be able to do it pretty easily. All right, how far is uh, 55? We're about to go over. Get us back on these interstates where we can do 80. Please. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. We're coming a little over left with that car over there. All right, now we gotta slow down. We're gonna go uphill. Oh, there's a cop right there. Wow, I'm glad we slowed down time. But, like I say, I think they let you uh, go over the speed limit by a few, which is nice. Alright, cruise control. It looks like some of the vehicles are more American style. I can't really remember Euro Truck Simulator, which, which, which vehicles they had. I can't remember. They definitely didn't have that. I don't know what that is. Oh, Chevy or whatever. Pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. All right, 
really wish we could go to an interstate. It says we're on Interstate 15, but if we're on the interstate, why are we going 15 miles an hour? 55 miles an hour. Right, off cruise control. Take this exit right here. Kingman and Flagstaff. Oh, slow down. All right. Oh, jeez. It's kind of tight. Uh, I don't feel like I have that bit great control. There we go. We made it. Oh, there's a car to the right. I really want to get over, too. Is there another ambulance coming up behind me? I need to go over the right lane. That's where we're supposed to be. Like some of these jackass truck drivers that act like they don't know that there's what lane they're supposed to be in. You're not supposed to be in the left lane. A bunch of people that do that too. Not just truck drivers. Alright. Another little two lane road. I think we had that last episode. At least it's 55, not 35. Well, I'd rather do 80 on the interstate. be nice too when they uh, update the map and they're supposed to do that for free at at least one or two other states I think is what they said and that DLC will be free which is nice because they only have what two Nevada and California we need more than that I remember American long haul uh, went clear across the United States it even had parts of Canada and Mexico in there oh wow, I was just slowing down I just hit the brake oh my god Oh, it's 40? Oh, jeez. I didn't know it was 40. I thought it was 55. You're flying. <laughs> I was hitting the brake right when they did that. I can't believe that. That was a grand, too. So much for the high-paying job. I think we need to get our lights on, apparently. What time is it? Monday, 6.45 p.m.? I think H does it. No. L. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, we're still speeding. What is... Alright, it's up to 65 now. It says 55, so I, right, so I guess we're 10 below what they... That makes sense. So is the speed limit 90 on those interstates? It's usually a 65 to 70 where I live. That looks like another... Badass old car. Look at all these wind farms. Windmills on the wind farm. Oh, uh, what happened to the plane up there? Sup, buddy? Hello, trucker. Oh, man. Look at all the traffic. I'm going for it. We shouldn't. I don't want to sit there for another hour. That truck might have actually turned. Alright, we're 95 miles out. That's in two and a half hours. Look at that sun. It's actually kind of annoying. Kind of nice looking, but kind of annoying. Kind of bright. That would be kind of one one of the cool things about being a trucker, getting to see stuff like that, seeing the like the entire country. Not the greatest lifestyle though. Ah, oh, geez, we're speeding again. Get her down to 58. There we go. Cruise control time. I just get going and I forget all about the speed limit. Stop doing that. Alright, we haven't driven in the night, and apparently we're going to. So we've got another hour 44 minutes, so it'll be after 9.30, it says, by the time we get there. I guess we're in California? Did we start out in Nevada? Going over Prim. I'm not sure where Prim is. Is that California or Nevada? I don't remember. I think it was Nevada. 
Alright, getting in the left lane because we gotta turn left up here. Looks like another two lane road. Got 43 more miles on this one, or well, until the destination. All of us going on this road. All right, she's 55. I wish it would be a little more clear about when it's going to shift. The speed limits got kind of screwed on that last one. Although we were already speeding, but I was just hitting the brake to slow down. Wish I had looked earlier. Kind of a nice little two-lane road, though. Like, would we get dinged if we went speeding right through here? I mean, there's no cops here, right? Like, if there's no cops around, will they ding you? Or, uh, I don't know. I need to get over to the right more, because if somebody comes through the other way, I'm kind of screwed. And it looked like the destination was on this road, though. I think I saw it up here. out on the left. Wow. The speed limit is 55, but you do not want to do it. You're cool, like I say, when they get the physics mods in there, and you will totally prevent you from doing that. See you flying. Alright. Up here on the left, though. I can't remember if oh, it's right, fertilizer. Oh, it makes sense we're in the farming area. Alright. We made it. Darshel. Is, is this. I thought uh, Northern California was the freaking wine area. Where do you want it? Where do you need it? Oh, jeez. That oh, jeez. Now, it's probably going to want you to pull forward high. Pulling... I wonder if, if I could come from the other side and just drive straight up through there. I'm not going to let that happen. I shouldn't have done this. I, mean, I like the added challenge, but they just, they made it too difficult. Because there's just not enough room. Come on. Accidentally hit forward there for a second. Ah, oh, we're... Come on, get back in the drive. All right. All right, now over a little bit. No, other way. Oh, I had it, and then I messed it up. I had it. Oh, we might actually get it. Be gentle. Oh, what are we hitting? Oh, the post. All right, well, we're, we're, we've almost got it. We're pretty much lined up. Just over a little bit. There we go. What are we hitting? Is the trailer hitting or is the truck hitting? Cab. I thought we had it that time. I 
I think we've got it. <laughs> oh, don't tell me. Ah, oh. this is difficult as heck, man. I can't believe they made it this hard. Oh, we should have it. We should have had it like two tries ago. There we go. There we go. Little corrections. No, wrong way. It helps if you don't screw that up. All right. Come on. So we got this post right here. We got to get around too. That's not helping anything out. See how narrow that is we had to come through? I didn't even notice it was that narrow until just now. I knew it was narrow, but dang. All right. Sweet. We, we got her. Took a little while, but we got her. 2818 proficiency bonus. Really? Do we get money for that? That's nice. 192 for delivering and 90 uh, for parking the trailer. So 2846 minus we paid a grand though in speeding. So we only really made 1800 bucks. I'm not sure if it's calculating that. I think it is. Bank. Oh, can we take out loans and stuff? That's kind of cool. I wonder how much... Uh, I don't think we can go to the truck dealers, can we? Oh. Not a sleeper. It's 122 grand. Let's go through these. All right, the T680 duty day cabin. I don't mind that. You can pull over and sleep at a wrist area. Kenworth T680 duty day cabin. I don't know. It's a little more horsepower. 4055 and 370. All right, so you don't have to be any specific level either. You got to be level eight to get that one, but that's cool that we can buy that white one. I want to do a few more jobs, get a little bit more money, and then we'll, maybe we can take out a loan. Level ten. Wow, level eighteen. Level twenty. All right. That's kind of cool. The nice snow though, because one hundred twenty-two grand, so we could take out a. $100,000 loan when we got like, say, 25, 30 grand. I mean, 1,800 bucks a day isn't, isn't, is nothing, right? Kind of like that. All right, well, we've got some emails. Check those out. To whom it may concern, we are looking for skilled driver with their own trucks. See, that's pretty cool. For a large number of deliveries, we offer competitive rates up to 4,500 for a job. That's awesome. Acquired directly at our dock in Las Vegas. He thought you might uh, like to know that we offer favorable loans. Yeah, okay. To new businesses. We just looked at that. At the bank. Sweet. All right, everybody. That uh, concludes episode number two for American Truck Simulator. I hope you all did enjoy it. Now I'll catch you guys on the next episode.